Kitchen. I'm Julia and today is kind of a different episode. This is an international superfun collab, which means I'm making a soup from my country, which is Denmark, and the two other guys are making a soup from their country. Over here we have Baron Morland and he's doing an Australian inspired soup. And over here we have Thomas from Ron's Kitchen and he's doing a German soup. Remember to check out these two channels after you watch me making this delicious soup and I'll just leave a link to their channels down below in the description. And today I'm making a creamy asparagus soup which is something we really really love here in Denmark. And in Danish we call it a spa soup. <laughs> so let's get going with this soup. For my creamy asparagus soup I will be using some water, cream, flour, some canned asparagus, salt, pepper, some bouillon cubes or stock cubes, butter and to decorate at the end I'll be using some fresh green asparagus. I'm also going to use some store bought meatballs which is pork and veal meatballs. This is just to show how quick this recipe really can be but I have made pork and veal meatballs in here before so I'll just leave a link to that video down below in my description. The first step is to sift my canned asparagus but I'm going to use both the asparagus and the juice. First up I'm going to melt my butter. My butter is now melted and I will be adding in my flour. And just whisk it well. Like that and then I add in my juice from my asparagus. And just whisk well again until it's all well combined. Like so, and now I will add in my water. I will also be adding in my bouillon cubes or stock cubes. And I will stir this and let it come to a boil. And then I will let it boil for around 5 to 7 minutes until the next step. It is very important to keep stirring in this soup, otherwise it will burn. My soup has now boiled for around 7 minutes and now it is time to add in my cream. And I will turn down the heat just a bit because after the cream is added, you cannot let it boil anymore. And from now on, I will just use a spoon to stir. And remember not to let it boil. And now I'll be adding in my meatballs. Like so. And then just in with some salt and some pepper. And when my meatballs are warm and defrosted, my soup is ready to be served. asparagus soup and if you want to make this you still just go down in the description and you can find all the videos down there. Don't forget to check out Baby Marlon's channel and Ron's Kitchen. I have left a link for those down below in the description and before they do
do that, remember to subscribe to my channel here and I hope to see you all again soon. Bye!